welcome back to my channel. This week's brand overview, and actually it's more of a concept overview, is from Beauty Pie. Now, Beauty Pie has to be up there in the list of things I'm asked most about in the history of the world ever, along with why I'm so obsessed with Simon Le Bon. Can't really answer the second one. I can tell you more about Beauty Pie. Um, I wanna, let me think, okay, I'll, I'll just do the concept first, and I'm gonna keep it in layman's terms, uh, because when they first started, I found myself going onto the website and not really clicking. I couldn't really get how it works. They have since, obviously, as with any new brand, they have since massively, um, not overhauled, I suppose really they've just had the capability to react to customer feedback, and they have done that in leaps and bounds, and it is now a no-brainer, super simple. So I'm gonna give you like layman's terms about how it actually works. I don't need to give you layman's terms, as I said, it's already easy. And then I'll give you my cherry-picked favorites from the brand. Um, first of all, background. Marcia Kilgore is renowned in the industry. She is a genius. There is nothing that woman has touched that has not been spectacular. She founded Bliss, Soap and Glory, Fit Flop, Super, Super Doper, I always say, Super Duper, <laughs> um, and Beauty Pie, and I'm sure there's something else I'm forgetting, which is really lame of me. But anyway, the woman is a walking, talking inventor. She's an inventor. She's not just a brand owner. She has a plan and she puts it to action probably more than anyone else I've ever seen in the industry. Um, Beauty Pie came to her as a concept because, as you know, in this industry there is a ton of product. There are a lot of brands and there are, but there are a limited amount of labs, really good labs. And Marcia had been in a really good lab that the whole of the industry will know in Italy, had a bag full of lab samples on her shoulder, went into Sephora and had this the thinking or an epiphany, I suppose she may call it, um, where the product on the shelf was X amount of pounds, euros. Um, and she had the same product in her bag that would have cost her three to five pounds, depending on if she'd put it into different packaging, etc. And she thought, why can't, if I can get access to this, why can't I give the woman at home access in the back door to the best labs in the world at the cost, the true cost of the goods that I would pay? So Beauty Pie is a membership club in the same way that you have Costco, you have Netflix, um, Spotify. Nowadays, they're just part of our vernacular. Um, beauty Pie is definitely the beauty version of those. You pay a membership fee every month. Most people start around 10. However, a word of advice, if you are a skincare freak, you know who you are, I would start at 20. You will thank me later. Um, you pay for access, basically. Being a member of the club gives you access to all of these products at the true cost price. For example, um, what's my favorite analogy? So this is one of my favorite products. You will recognize these. If I covered that up, you would think it was two or three other brands. This is £4.80, something like that. And in the shops, it's 22. It's literally five times the cost. So. The same works for the skincare. Now, all of the mainstream, luxury, high-end, beauty, skincare and makeup brands source their products from the exact same labs that Beauty Pie and Mossia use. So, in some cases, she's getting the products first because a lab is a lab, they just wanna sell their product. Um, and that she's not tied by having to use the same lab for manufacturing. The labs are now in the position, she's now in the position where the labs are calling her and saying, dude, we've got this amazing product, do you want it? And she's like, yes. So that's how it works in a nutshell. It's, it's a no brainer. It is um, different membership fees. You can also boost it. So if you are particularly, if you need more things than you do normally, you can boost it and have a bigger spend that month. So you're paying your membership fee monthly and that gives you access to all of this. Um, there are some great makeup bits, however you know that I'm obsessed in the skincare realm. So just to give you a little quick look, lip crayons, obsessed, just good colors. Hmm, don't mind if I do. Um, these will look very familiar to a lot of you. Eyeshadow pencils. Remember, do these look familiar? Yes, I bet they do. Um, and then just a quick shout out, if you are a fan of a lipstick that you can put on without a mirror, and I'm, I know I'm gonna have like 15 different lipsticks on, but that's okay. This pink 
is it naked pink? Naked pink? Naked pink is, uh, just trust me, trust me, have a look at naked pink. The lipsticks are soft, juicy, they give colour but they don't stain, so you can just do this in the car quickly, just gorgeous. However, I want to show you some key bits of skincare because I sense we will have a lot of questions and I will be in the comments afterwards and I'm sure Marcia will join in too. So let me just quickly show you in essence how it works. There are different groupings, um, different products, different categories for the skincare. There are ranges from different countries, there are ranges for different types of skin. It is super simple to shop on the website. You'll get a drop down, you can click cleansers, you can click serums, you can click SPF whatever it is you're looking for. But in essence, for the 20 pound mark, you're gonna get around 200 pounds a month to spend, but it's only gonna cost you about 60. That's in essence how it works. Okay, I'm gonna start with cleansing and go through. We'll see how we go because there's a lot to get through, like I said, and I wanna minimize how much you have to ask me to get the information, but I just wanna get it out there. Okay, double phase daily deep rinse off cleanser. Now this is one of the first cleansers they launched, I believe. It's not the first one that I had in my hand. That was Japan Fusion, which is this. Now I love this cleanser. They're very slightly in that this is, they both emulsify. I never do that. I know I'm the freak. I can't explain it. I just like to use a cloth. Um, the Japan Fusion Gentle and Traceless Perfect Makeup Cleansing with Antioxidant Vitamin C and Great Polyphenols. I love the Japan Fusion line. Just put that here for a second. I will use this AM and PM. I don't just use it in the case of makeup removal. Whereas this one, I tend to only use to take my makeup off. I'm doing this again. It didn't take long, did it? Um, removes makeup, soothes and purifies. So this is your makeup remover that is also suitable for your morning cleanse. This is a makeup remover, but I prefer it for a morning cleanse. You do not have to have both. It is merely my preference. I just want to quickly show you the texture. They're both very similar. They are so light. Let me see if I can give you a little shot here. Um, they look like a gel, but they feel like a lotion and they disappear really nicely. They don't go oily on the skin. Excuse me while I get my usual. Um, they're just super, super soft, super sensitive, super smoothing. Soothing, smoothing. Actually a bit of both. Another cleanser, now this is beautiful. Again, it will look familiar. This is Plantastic, matches my camo. Thank you, scampin' dude. Um, this, oh, okay. This is a buttery balm. I don't know if you can see this. I'm gonna do close-ups of everything, obviously. This balm is, I have um, some questions over the summer where I was saying to people with a slightly more mature skin, if you have a true, dry, mature skin, you don't really want to use too heavy a balm because you're going to have to drag your skin to take it off. This one wipes off like a dream, which means it will wash off like a dream with a flannel. You'll still be able to get movement when you're doing cleansing, but it's not going to be heavy and sticky and drag the face. So three cleansers. Plantastic is your balm. Double Phase is Makeup Remover Stroke Daily. And Japan Fusion is my most used, if I'm honest and it might be something to do with it being pink. Okay, the rest of the Japan Fusion line is where I'm gonna start because it is the one I've easily used the most. There's only four products in the whole line. There's the cleanser, there is Hydro Prep Lotion, the serum, and the cream. Should have done the other way around. Um, I would guess they are Beauty Pie's best-selling products because it's a known fact in the industry that pink packaging will up your sales. Sad but true, people, sad but true. Why not yellow? rude. Um, the prep lotion is in essence, an essence, see what I did there, but it is really really soothing and hydrating and this is pretty good for any skin that wants a little bit of moisture or a little bit of, of a boost. This would be nice for you if you have particularly oily skin and you don't really want to go down the moisturiser road, although, although there are other options you might prefer. The Japan Fusion range is lush. Serum's beautiful, the cream is like a jelly. It's so pretty. Um, and they hydrate really well, they go on really well, they both work really well under makeup. I'm pulling my sleeves up now, I'm getting into it. Okay, 
Let's touch on the retinol because I also sense that the retinol must be up there in terms of her best selling products. These retinols are micro encapsulated. They are at varying strengths. They list it all on the website. There's no need to go into detail here, but they're completely transparent about their products. There's no hidden formulas, blah, blah, blah. So if you're that kind of freak, you can go and have a look. That's not an insult, by the way. If you're new to me, that is very much a term of endearment. Um, but the retinols themselves, there's an eye, a serum, and a moisturizer, and a hand. I'm gonna focus on the face ones. Are so gentle that you can use them morning and night for the rest of your life, all together or underneath other products, just to make sure you get the retinol boost. You won't overstimulate your skin. It won't seem um, like you've been using a retinol. It won't feel harsh. Let me just give you a little taster. So that's the serum. Oh, that's the moisturizer next to it. Serum, moisturizer, eye cream, as you would expect. Lightest, middle, slightly more texture. They are all really, really soft. Um, as I say, minimal, minimal interference with the skin. Visible interference with the skin is probably what I would say. Highly recommend. I love that this, because they have so many variations, I love that you can jump all over the place. Couple of shout outs, okay. Fruity Zyme 5 Minute Facial. This is the one you've probably seen the most of on social. It was picked up by a couple of um, reviewers in particular. And I understand why they gave this such a rave review because they're the kind of people that don't really use a lot of acid. It's called 5 Minute Facial. It is, it acts, it feels like a scrub. Super, super smoothing, purifying and resurfacing. Alpha hydroxy acids and pomegranate en enzyme. Pomegranate enzyme. Thanks. Um, don't be tempted to scrub it all over your face. Apply it leave it for five minutes and then just quickly scrub it off. That is the best way to use it. If you want instant kapow, I look like I've had sleep, I'm knackered, I'm lying to everyone. That's for you. If spots are your main concern, if or oh, those hormonal humdingers that come around here that just seem to set up camp, plantastic micro peeling super drops. Now, think of other peels that are on the market in a nice little dropper like this, uh, pore refining, exfoliating, perfecting with fruit smoothers and salicylic acid. It is really light, not sticky, like this. You can dab it onto the spot and leave it in the area and then put all your other creams on top. It's not silicone based, so everything else works on it like a dream. You can apply it at night if you feel them coming out. You can reapply it during the day. All of these products have all the testing that was done at the lab all behind them. They all stand solidly on their own as individual ranges. The best way to use Beauty Pie to my mind is to dip and dab. I've got Plantastic Balm, I've got Japan Fusion Essence, just dip and dab. And then every month, if you haven't spent your allowance, which you obviously will, <laughs> if you haven't, it rolls over and you can beef it up next month. You can also do things like beef it up for Christmas time if you want to buy more or you want to buy something for your mum or whatever. Speaking of mums, this one and this one. If you have either a drier skin or a more mature skin, you're looking at Plantastic, number one, which is this one. This is if you're dry. If you want the ultimate anti-aging cream, Super Healthy Skin is for you. They are varying in terms of viscosity and this is very definitely for a drier skin, which you'll see when you look at it. Looks slightly more Oh, slightly more balmy. However, it's not heavy and greasy, so you're not gonna get that horrible, thick feeling of grease, which is very 1980s. It's very dynasty, darling. Um, super healthy skin, ultimate anti-aging cream, visibly lifting, firming, plumping, hyaluronic acid, da 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 da. Now, I don't wanna go into all the details. This is easily, if this was on the shelf and it was made by one of the mainstream corporate luxury beauty brands, it would be well over 100 quid. And I am that freak of a person who can tell a cream and its quality by the texture. I've been doing this a long time. There's a lot of us out there in the industry who, who can do it. I remember a very famous facialist once came up to me in the counter in a store and said, well, these all contain silicone, don't they? And I was like, no, I should keep the brand and the facialist nameless. And she kind of went like this and went, oh, no, they don't. There's just that, you just know, a a mass market product in your hand and you know the feel of something that's a more exquisite formula. This is not done on the cheap. That's the main thing here. If you think of 
this explosion into the industry um, of cheaper products, everything under a tenner, single ingredient formulas that are basically a bulk ingredient watered down and put in a bottle and sold to you. You get much more for your buck with Beauty Pie. You're paying the same price as you would, but they are a finished, complete formula. Um, I'm gonna do maybe two or three more because I realize it could go on forever. But like I say, I will be in the comments because there will probably be a lot. Let me cherry pick. Okay, I'm gonna cherry pick these three. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, this is the problem. Super healthy skin, daily moisture lotion. Brightening, smoothing and nourishing. This is for you if you want one place to start and you need a moisturizer and you don't have dry skin and you're not concerned with the signs of aging because you're treating those with a serum, perhaps. Um, this lotion is suitable for all skins. Looks like this. You would think it's gonna be heavier than the others. Massage is away like a dream. Everything works well on top of it. It's a go-to for daily hydration. You want a bloody good moisturizer. You don't wanna pay 55 quid for it. Bob's your uncle. SPF. Um, SPF is notoriously difficult to get right. There are three different um, main bodies of regulations. There's the USA, there's the EU, and there's Australia. They're all different. It is a mare. So when I get constant questions saying, why can't I buy this in Australia? Why can't I buy this in the States? Blame your individual regulatory bodies. It's not the brand. It is all run very carefully. To that note, the fact that they've managed to do ultralight UVA, UVB, SPF 25, hyaluronic acid, look this SPF is divine. It is super light. I'm just going to show you again. Massages in seconds, disappears, no ash, no bounce back. Lovely, heavy SPF smell. God, I love it. Although it feels weird smelling SPF and wearing a sweatshirt. Okay. This product is my favorite texture and probably the one that I would say if you have a daily moisturizer and you want to try something different or you want a night cream, you're going from autumn into summer into autumn or you're already in, it's sort of cold where you are anyway. There's a wealth of reasons. This Jiju, Jeju, I don't know, I'm sorry. Overnight moisture super infusion looks like this. Now, this texture looks like butter that's been left in a freezer. It is a balm that you almost pull out of your, with your finger, or you have to scrape it with your nail. But, here is the magic. It looks like this, okay? Once you rub in, it literally starts to dissipate into a mixture, this beautiful hybrid of oil and water. And the glow is off the charts. So, if you want instant comfort, let's do it that way for a change, rather than traditional skin types. Instant comfort, for me, Japan Fusion Essence, Jiju, Jeju, Jeju, Overnight Moisture Super Infusion. Instant comfort. Solid anti-aging, don't mess about, takes no prisoners. The Retinol Range and the Super Healthy Skin Cream. Daily, oh, I do love the banging of the product. Um, daily moisturizer, don't have a lot of problems, already have expensive serums, would like to tiptoe into the range. Super Healthy Skin Daily Moisture Lotion, Mwah. Cleansing, oh, uh, cleanses do weird things to me, I can only apologize. Okay, makeup remover, double phase daily deep rinse off cleanser. You can put it all over, you can put it all over on dry skin, massage it through with a flannel, that's my preference. You can emulsify if you want. Japan Fusion, um, just a really nice feeling cleanser, just does the job nicely, not too astringent, not too sticky, uh, not in any way drying, none of them are drying. Plantastic Apricot Butter Cleansing Balm. This would be my fave for this time of year. But, oh, maybe when I die, that'll be my epitaph, a picture of me with a cleansing balm like that. That's nice, isn't it? For children, I'm gonna put a cleanser on my gravestone. Um, this is gorgeous. If you want a balm cleanser, it is beautiful. And then, I keep saying I'm gonna finish, but these are definitely gonna, just the overview. Super dry skin, plantastic is for you. And then spots, the hormonal stuff you have going on, micro peeling super drops. And literally dab on the finger or you can, these drops are the one thing I can say you can, if you want to do this hideous Instagram trend of where you drop it straight onto a spot. You can do that with a spot treatment, don't do it with anything else. 
it's not attractive people it makes for very entertaining footage in my facebook group though i hope that was helpful um i'm going to list the bullet points below but like i say it's now super simple if you are a skincare lover makeup too and i know there's a lot of makeup obsessives with beauty pie i mean the brushes like look. but as usual i'm all obsessed about skin if you are obsessed about skincare you want affordability and you want traceability and accountability it is a no-brainer all of the sign up details will be below um, keep an eye out on my social media i'll be highlighting other pieces i think i've got a blog post coming up on this for example have a wicked weekend i cannot remember what is next um, it's busy though it's all good um, thank you so much for watching and i will see you soon bye